so today I am going to be doing something I've been wanting to do for a very long time now. Um, I wanted to do the Dollar Tree Makeup Challenge. I've been watching these for a very long time and been wanting to do one on my own for a long time. So I'm going to first use this sassy and chic moisturizing foundation. This is the lightest foundation I found there. I got this LA Colors liquid makeup. And look how dark that is. I found this, which thought it might help me lighten up the foundations a little bit. Um, and this is the LA Colors Conceal and Correct. And this one's in the shade Lavender. And I grabbed this thinking it was powder, but it's actually the Color Mates Compact Makeup in the shade Light. It smells so, like, chemically, but of course it is because it's from Dollar Tree. But it's very thick. Grabbed their sponge. I'm gonna you try, I love sponges to apply foundation more than anything but I have a little bit of the foundation on a palette and I'm just gonna I don't know if I use too much or what dot it on my face and then I have I'm just gonna use the bottom of this and see what it does I and I know this is going to be so sticky. I Okay. So, if you use a lot, it's not so bad. Like, I got some coverage down there. It's actually not terrible. It might get my face itch. So, I'm going to stop applying that one. And it also smeared a lot of my coverage off. So I would say no, no on this. Don't buy this one. But on top of that, I'm going to use the, the compact makeup and see how good it is. As long as you pat these products in, they're not that terrible. Um, okay, so I'm going to use this concealer. Look at that. Brightens it. Use some of that compact makeup again and get it on the brush. Actually, we covered that dang pimple pretty good. So I'm pretty impressed. It's not bad. So I did something a little bit weird. They have these new things. Um, they're the LA Colors like little contouring duos or something. Um, and I'm going to of course use the contour but I didn't get a powder because I thought this was a powder. But instead, it was foundation. Um, it's just a cream foundation. So, I am, and this actually matches, is pretty close to my skin tone. So, I'm going to use it, not just under my eyes, I'm going to use it all over my face as a powder. And I found these Wet n Wild, uh, angled brushes. They're called the contour brushes. And I'm going to take a good amount of that powder and powder my face. I'm just going to use a little bit of the contour. I have this I got this LA Girls Single Blush in Sweet Cheeks. They have a couple of other ones as well. The greatest. Ooh! 
Okay. The blush is pigmented. To highlight, I actually got an eyeshadow to highlight. But I got this LA Colors eyeshadow palette and it's in the color Lily. I got this thinking that this white would be a pretty good highlight. And then I got this Wet n Wild. It's like a fluffy crease brush. And I got two of these. One for my eyes and one for the face. That's pretty good for a for Dollar Tree. I zoomed in here and I'm gonna use I'm gonna do my brows. I found this color mate. Um, brow powder in the shade dark brown and it, they had a wet and wild angle brush but for some weird reason like I guess I thought I didn't need it or something and I didn't end up grabbing it so I'm gonna have to use this really pretty suckish brush for my brows but grabbed this little they have these little compact mirrors I'm gonna use this for my as a mirror for my brows and my eyes. It looks a little bit too brown for my hair color. Okay, so then I'm gonna do my eye, my eyeshadow, um, and. For that, I grabbed this LA Colors Matte Eyeshadow in the shade Matte Terrific. That's super cute. Also grabbed the LA Colors Eye Eyeshadow that's in the shade Supernatural on the back. And I thought I could add some blue if I got this palette so that just to add a pop of something. Start out using this Wet n Wild brush. It's the same brush I used on my face. The color right here, kind of like a light eyeshadow color. For yeah, I'm just gonna use this for my crease shades. So I'm gonna start out with this one right here. Blend it in my crease. This shade down here, and use it as well in the same area go ahead and jump right into that darkest color and put it on the outer corner for the lower lash line i'm gonna do that pop of blue that i was talking about this shade right here is kind of like a navy blue color this little flat brush is just called i think this one was called the smudge brush And then I'm going to use the brush we used for the crease and smudge it out a little bit. So a little trick that I'm going to show you guys is I'm going to use this, that same Wet n Wild brush that was called the concealer brush and I'm going to use that cream um, foundation that we use on our face. And I'm gonna take some more of that just on my lid. And then you can put a little bit in the inner corner. I used that LA Colors um, used earlier. And that same white color and another wet n wild eyeshadow brush pat it on top of that cream color and you can see that just creates a really nice base for it to stick onto I'm going to take that same shadow 
in my waterline. So I'm going to use this Colormates liquid eyeliner. I've never used... Whoa! And I've never used a liner like this before. I've always used a felt tip eyeliner. Um, I'm just going to try it and see how it turns out. Apply. So, actually, I really like that eyeliner. It turned out pretty good. Um, pink Dollar Tree eyelash curler. It's super cute. And then I got this Wet n Wild Mega Wear mascara in the shade Berry Black. For a dollar each. This makeup is really good. Okay, so actually the eyes turned out pretty good. I actually really like it. Now I'm going to do my LA colors, my lips. I'm gonna do my LA colors. I'm doing I'm gonna do my lips. I have this LA colors chunky lip pencil. I think it's in coral. I think it's in coral red. Okay, so I can actually tell you that I am really, really impressed with this makeup um, and how well it turned out. I love a lot of the products. The only things I don't really like is the lipstick. Uh, it's pretty good for the Dollar Tree, but um, my, my bottom lip here, which you guys can't really tell, it has some it's like kind of separated a little bit it looks a little bit funny um, I don't enjoy the eyelash curler very much um, it just didn't curl my lashes good don't like the LA colors liquid makeup so those are the I'll say those are the three things I don't really love but all the rest of the products worked pretty well but yeah um, thank you guys so much for watching. Um, please like, comment, and subscribe. It really helps me. And I will see you guys in my next one. Bye.